So here's the first tool that I want to get into within working with a list inside of Excel. And this is perhaps one of the most common tools that are used inside of a list. Now, think about this. What's the purpose of a list? Think about that. Well, it's to store data. I've got a list of employee records. I've got to put those someplace. Well, I stored the data there. Well, why are you storing the data? Well, I'm storing the data so that later on I can find it. Yeah, you, the, ultimately the purpose of a list is so that you can work with the data, you can find the data. Well, one of the most effective ways of finding data is organizing it properly, sorting the list. I want to sort this list to make it easier to find specific records. So let's think about this for a moment. What might be something you would sort this list by so that you can more easily make this list more accessible so that you can find that data. Think about that for a moment. Look at those column headers. What would you sort this list on to make it easier to find? Well, you might think, well, it depends on what you're looking for. Well, if I'm just looking for specific employees, maybe I'll sort this list by last name, right? I'll sort it by last name so I get it in ascending order, A to Z, and I can skim through the list to find those specific employees with specific last names. Oh, well, you know what? I want to find employees that work in a specific location. Well, hey, no problem. We'll sort the list by location. Building ones, building twos, building threes, we'll put it in the proper order to make it easier to find things. Hey, think about this. Anybody use a phone book anymore? Do you still get one of those on your doorstep? I got one a few months back and I thought, what am I going to do with that? Right? Right to the recycle bin. Okay? I, I, I don't use them anymore, but think about this. What if a phone book wasn't sorted? Would you find anything? It might, you might find something, but it would take you forever to find it because it's not organized properly in an accessible way. So we sort the list to make it easier to find. So here's the first method on sorting a list. Really simple. Watch this. I want to sort my list by last name. So I click into the last name column doesn't matter where, just anywhere in the column, and I'm going to perform what I call a quick sort. I want to sort by last name. I identify that by clicking into it. I'm going to go up to my data tab. On my data tab, I got a place called sort and filter, and in there I got three sort buttons. But the first two are my quick sorts. I can sort ascending, I can sort descending. I'm going to do an ascending, A to Z. I'll give that a click, and I've now sorted my list by last name in ascending order. You can see A, B, C, D, F, G, and so on. Really simple. Click into the column you want to sort on. I wanted to do it by last name. Go up to data. Make your selection. Ascending or descending order. Whatever is going to make it easier for you to find the data. So try this out. Identify how you want to sort this list. What's going to make it easier to find specific records? Well, I did it by last name. You might do it by department, you might do it by location, you might do it by hire date. Whatever it is, head up to the data tab, select your order. You've now sorted your list and made it more accessible.